Hello operators, this is not a press conference. This is a press statement, a statement for the press. I've been, my phone has been blowing up, my telex has been blowing up, I've been getting telegrams all day and night. I want to put all the rest right now. BBC, CNS Asia, the Christian Science Monitor, everybody is on my ass. And it's all because I shaved my beard. Let me think, there's got to be five. Let me count them. Hana, Dual, Set, Net, Dawson. Oh, wait, did I just count in Korean? I can edit that out. There's speculation. The reason I shaved my beard, and there's some things that people are trying to tie incidents together and include me in. There's some people who say that I shaved my beard so that I could go to Luke Air Force Base here in Arizona, get on board a super secret, some kind of high altitude plane, and fly to North Korea. And somehow, I had to have a mask so I could do a halo, high altitude, low opening. <laughs> I'm not a jumper, I'm a leg. I don't jump out of the airplane. But the story goes, and the reporters are taking off with it, that I jumped into North Korea, and I had to shave my beard because you don't see beards in North Korea, and if you do, they're usually on a woman. But that I got into North Korea somehow, and somehow I have access to medical devices, uh, or medical equipment. I don't know where anybody could get that. Is this working? Can you guys hear me? That I got medical devices and somehow I affected uh, the operation with Kim Il-jung. These stories are not true. I don't even know how to say his name correctly, but I had nothing to do with whatever happened in North Korea that we don't even know what happened yet. Maybe nothing even happened yet. See? So what I want to say is, you know, I understand conspiracy theories and speculation, all that stuff, but think about it, folks. When in the history of the United States has our government ever involved itself in the goings on of another country? When have we ever directly or indirectly intervened in what a leader of another country does? When have we tried to ever affect an outcome of anything in another country? This is all hooey and all hogwash. And I'm got up in the middle of it. So if you're an operator, whether you're tier one or tier one, you know you're welcome here. I'll always tell you the truth. I had nothing to do with what's going on or went on in North Korea. And TMZ, you're pissing me off with that punchline. TMZ on the DMZ. Fat man seen low crawling back into South Korea. Really? Get a life.